The Cats entertain Kamloops in a doubleheader. More from Adam Donnelly. Kamloops Blazers in town facing the Cougars in the back end of a weekend series here in Prince George. The Blazers took the home opener from the Cougars on Friday by a 4-2 score, due in large part to the play of goaltender Taryn Cozen. Early in the first, the Blazers swarm the Cougars' crease, but Ty Edmonds keeps the puck out. Zach Pachiro takes a holding minor on the play, and Kamloops gets an early power play. After killing the penalty, Alex Forsberg wins an offensive zone draw. The initial shot is stopped by Kozen, but Forsberg's there to bury the rebound. 1-0 Cougars in the first. Later on in the period, Sam Griss pinches down for Kamloops. The puck gets by him and the Cougars have a two-on-one. Murkonic passes off the goalie's pad to Morrison. Kozen dies but can't get enough as Brad Morrison pots his second goal of the season. Cougs up 2-0. Prince George gets a late power play, but Cozen shuts the door on the Cats. Cougars lead 2-0 at the break. Off the opening draw on the second, Captain Troy Burke skates the puck in and makes the iron sing. He grabs his own rebound, then spins and fires it home. Cougars up 3-0. Hometown boy Josh Connolly cut the Cougars lead to two later in the second as he got one back for the Blazers. Late in the third, the Kamloops net empty, the Blazers trying desperately to score, but Ty Edmonds shuts the door. The Cougars pick up their second win of the young season with a 3-1 victory over the Blazers here at home. I thought we were a lot better here today. I thought we uh, played a very good team game. I thought we uh, were very unselfish. Um, you know, I thought we were, uh, we were a lot better. And, uh, you know, you got to give their goaltender some credit here tonight, boy. We threw another 40-some shots at them, and, uh, and they gave him a chance. They gave him a chance to hold that long. So uh, I'm happy with their effort. There was contributions from everybody. There wasn't a whole lot of passengers here today. 